Okay, I'm out here working on a um, Lennox heat pump, and the customer had several companies out here. One guy said the compressor was bad, another guy said the unit was overcharged, and that was definitely uh, the issue. The uh, unit, basically what I did, you had a uh, filter dryer down in the um, down in the heat pump itself, so. I had like two degrees um, differential on one side of the filter dryer and the other, so I went on and snatched it out from the inside of the unit, and I put it out here. And it's way easier to get to, so I just went on and ran straight pipe off of the uh, TXV on the inside. But the um, the unit, when I took my took a, uh, I went on and evacuated all of the freon out of the system first before I could do all of that. But what was happening here is the unit was um, running okay in the cooling mode, but the line was really, really cold. And, and the, um, in the heat mode, it would lock out on high pressure. So I knew something wasn't right. So basically what I did, I just went on and evacuated the system. I weighed the, I weighed the uh, Freon into the tank, empty tank, and this unit was like it was actually four pounds over believe it or not and causing that unit to do what it did so it may have been five or six pounds over I don't know how much the guy other guy took out but that's the easiest way to find out um, what's going on with your system if your unit is locking out on high pressure I mean it's just climbing on high pressure uh, 500 plus and uh, just go ahead and lock it out so the easiest way to do that is uh, evacuate the system you don't have to change the filter dryer all the time. I guess it depends on how old the unit it was. This unit was six years old, so I just went on and um, changed the filter dryer while I already had the uh, system empty. And it was a pain to get to, but I got to it. And like I said, I ran uh, just a uh, 3 8 copper on the inside by the TXV and put the uh, filter dryer out here. But anyway, the best fix, the easiest fix, is just pull all the Freon out of the system and, uh, and weigh it in according to a uh, factory specs. So now it's doing what it's supposed to do. All right, Iceman signing out.